I just had breakfast and I had three biscottis that Amber made. I put extra crunchy peanut butter on them, so probably like two tablespoons, and then a little more than half a banana, like three-fourths of a banana, and I'll just eat the rest of this one. But I should have taken a picture, but the power's out, and I'm feeling kind of mad this morning. Not like sick, just like lazy. I feel like anytime the power's out, my head goes into a, well, today's canceled, the power's out, can't do anything, which isn't true, because it's not even nine o'clock. Oh, I got, oh yeah, I, I put chia seeds on top of, on top of the biscotti and peanut butter and banana. Hi, little cat. She's very cute. What are you doing? She wants me to pet you. You want me to pet you? You want me to pet you? Where are we going? Oh, I know what you want. Do you want the drip? Come get the drip. There you go, look. Is that good water? Oh, you're the cutest. So, since it is a power outage day and the network is down, I can't get any internet, even on my phone, nothing is loading. I'm gonna rearrange the living room because I want to see how it looks. So here's a little overview. Here's the front door where Mr. Fluffy is sitting, hoping that Finn comes inside, but not right now, baby. So yeah, I have the TV on this wall. Now one of the issues that I have with the couch being over here is that the curtains don't hang. They like push to the side or I have to pull the couch forward. And then there's a gap behind the couch, which I feel like is a bit weird. So I'm gonna move the couch over onto this wall. So the L will be that way. This will go here. And then the TV will go in front of the window because that should still have enough of a gap that I can close the curtains or put the blinds down if I wanna watch TV. So here's what we have so far. Hmm. I don't hate it. All right, let me go ahead and move this couch and then see. Okay, I'm a little out of breath from pushing all this around, but whew, here is what we have. I'm gonna leave it for the day. But my gut instinct says no, I don't like it. And the cats can't look out the window this way. Like, they love standing on top of the back of this couch and looking out the window. Mama Cat, you need to chill. Eh, I'm going to send Amber a picture and see what she thinks. The cats aren't super thrilled that they can't easily look out this window. Uh, hmm. Now one thing I could do would be move this into my bedroom, put the couch like this, the L couch, and then put the TV back on this wall. I don't know. <laughs> this is so hard. Mama, please don't hurt the TV. She 
She is looking for trouble. Also, RIP to my fiddle leaf fig. It is struggling. Ugh, I feel bad for it. Mr. Fluffy, tell me what to do. How would you like this rearranged? Oh, I don't know. This is fine. I just want to stuck my sisters. Do to do. This cat goes into the plant and knocks rocks out of it and then plays with them. What's she gonna do to them? I'll try to catch a, catch a video of her doing it. It's very cute. Also very annoying. Okay, the TV is in the guest room. It looks really nice there. Here's the bed. It's got my curtains and I'm gonna hem on it. Yeah, that looks pretty nice. Please don't break the TV cats. Do, 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 do. And let's look here. So this curtain is still an issue because it's still going to be squished by the sectional. I don't know. My cats are trying me today. Why are you up there? I'm laying on the futon. She jumps on top of the door to get on top of this cabinet thing. And now she's trying to walk on the air con. Mr. Fluffy's jealous. Remember how you fell last time you did this? And this time I'm sitting here, so please don't fall on me. Yeah. You got yourself into this situation. What are you gonna do? Wow, I'm very impressed. Do not climb the screen. He likes climbing screens. So I just looked out the window. Hello, little cat. Why are you so close? And yeah, the gardener has tilled. I don't think that's the right word. Turned up all the dirt and is pulling out all the rocks and concrete from when David had his container there. But yeah, it's wild looking. What do you think, little cat? Isn't that wild? Whoa. Here mama goes with her dang rock again. Mr. Fluffy. Mr. Fluffy is all puffed up and about to attack mama cat. Hey, what are you doing? Why are you all puffed up? Why are you being a crazy cat? Are you being a crazy cat? <laughs> crazy boy. Hi. Hello. It's 10.30 um, and the power just came back on. Sorry, I was just seeing if I liked this background. I do. Yeah, 
so I guess I need to stop being a bum and get some work done. So I'm going to do some schoolwork since hopefully the internet and the network is working. Mr. Fluffy and the other cats have calmed down. She's going to watch me supervise me making lunch. So I have some leftover black bean burgers. I'm going to do a wrap with black bean burgers, some onions and peppers, some more chickpeas, cheese, salsa. Woo! Okie dokie. So, depending on how hungry I am, I might eat that, but here's lunch. I put a little bit of this spicy tikka masala mayo on it, some salsa. Mm-mm, good. And I'll probably have some chips with it. What do you think, Mama? Does it look like a good lunch? <laughs> all right. Well, alrighty. So I'm growing up some more three green peppers, two onions, one red pepper. I need to get more red peppers if I can. Well, I did not film anything yesterday evening. I completely meant to, but while I was making dinner, I was uploading the day before's YouTube video, so. Anyway, for dinner, I pretty much had exactly what I had for lunch, and I worked on schoolwork. Nathan and David came over at one point. I should have made them say hi to the vlog, but I did not, so. Anyway, very exciting day once again. <laughs> Today we are going to Kitwe for a doctor's appointment for Amber, so I will let you know how that goes. Bye!